man if you are new to this channel hit that subscribe button I'm already ready to go for Madden 25 baby y'all better hit that subscribe button because we coming is the home we coming the with the Washington Commanders and, this and Jayden Daniels to you baby by EA Sports it's the Commanders and the Ravens all that and more coming up next it's the National Football League presented by EA Sports Tonight, it is all on the line. We play for the Lombardi Trophy, as it'll be the AFC champion, Baltimore Ravens, taking on the NFC champions, the Washington Commanders. Alongside my good friend Charles Davis, I'm Brandon Gordon. Well, CD, the Ravens have perennially been in the conversation. This year, they knock down that door, they win the AFC, and here they are in the Super Bowl. And remember, they've won in recent years. Super Bowl 35 in Tampa, Super Bowl 47 in New Orleans. What a stretch they could put together if they could claim another title here. Meanwhile, the <coughs> Commanders making their first appearance in this game with their new nickname. Remember, under their previous moniker, they made the big game five times and won it three of those. But it's been more than 30 years since their last appearance here, partner. Super Bowl 26 in Minneapolis. That was the old Metrodome. Mark Rippon leading them to victory in that one. The 2023 season has one game left. Here we go. Super Bowl 58 underway from Vegas. All right, come in. Let's clean him up, baby. Let's clean him up out of the gate. Let's go defense. He's dropped at the 23. The Ravens offense going to work, and as usual, it's Lamar Jackson, the former MVP of the league, at the helm. And no doubt he's living out a dream right now. He's had dating back to his first days of playing football as a kid, but he certainly can't get lost in the moment right now. There's still a Super Bowl to be played, and his offense, they're looking to him to be their leader. You got to contain Lamar, I know that. And when it's over, right now, you got the biggest game of your life. Look at him, he's taking off already. Taking off already. Where you going, boy? Only a couple for him there on the game's first play, and it's second down. Some teams like to start aggressive to begin a drive, but this is still what you expect to see in normal situations. Just call a simple run, get a few yards to begin the series, and set yourself up for something bigger on second down. From the 25, here's second down and eight. Jackson. He's got the hook up to down back him. And they're able to get this one across the 35. It's a pickup of 11 and a Baltimore first down. This has to go down as one of the simpler routes in the playbook, but oh so effective. Nice completion there. Keeps the sticks moving. And they run the got you, here. got you, Jackson. We're waiting on you, boy. We're waiting on you. There is he's gonna go down immediately. Two yards. Good job, Dean. Burning Dean. And not a lot of success to be found there. Oh, you got that right, partner, because if you're trying keep to make running, Lamar, keep running. Keep running. Downfield, you can push it all point, you want. Keep you running. Do it in your own backfield. I consider that a problem. That doesn't work too well. First oh, look at the D. Look at the D. We came to play, baby. This is the Super Bowl. Quickly, as he's going to be that, stopped. Daryl Brink is stolen. That second down play nets a minus four. I think it might be time to move to a different section of the playbook there because back-to-back -back runs, both for loss. Now they have third and long coming up. Back -back Let's go, defense. Plays, putting them in Let's take care of business, territory. baby. Let's they take they care of business. Let's go. On third and 15. From the gun, Jackson. Get him, get him. Yes. 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 One first down here, and that's all, folks. Good work by this defense to hold things in check and force a punting situation. Facing fourth down, Baltimore will punt Jordan Stout out there. A 40-yard punt, give him three on the return. And it will be Washington football now with a first and ten. So out comes the Washington offense onto the field. And they will be let out by their 6-4 quarterback. As we begin the Super Bowl, we're looking at one of the game's most important players. And whether he's the centerpiece of the offense or taking a backseat to his teammates. Been playing college football so much, guys. I got to learn my playbook again. To be a leader in moments like this. He's got to be that calm, composed pillar out there who stays level-headed and keeps everyone focused on the task at hand. And only able to get two here. Stopped at the 30. 
This Super Bowl, of course, just a huge one for this head coach. The first time he's walked the sidelines in a game of this magnitude. And you know, I might normally ask the cliche, what's going through his mind right now? But maybe the better question, CD, what do you think are the pitfalls of being a first time head coach? We're caught your blitzing, baby. We're you caught your blitzing. Let's go. Brandon, he had to. And he was thinking about it long before he got to this stage. As the season progressed, and he saw that his team was good. If he was smart, he started to make plans right then and there. Reach out to other coaches who've been there before. Find out how they handled winning, losing, handling all the ticket situations, travel, practice, all those things. And then trust your gut, make your best decision, and put it all out there and give your team their best chance to win. In on the stop, the former Georgia Bulldog, Roquan Smith. Here's second and seven. That brings us to the end of one in Super Bowl 58. Much more to come from Las Vegas after this. Can't wait to see what the second quarter has in store. This is the NFL on EA Sports. And we are back. Biggest game of the year, the Super Bowl, and both teams ready for the start of the second quarter. Here's a second and seven. Oh no! Come on, guys, catch him! There he goes left side. Oh no! It's a pick six and a Raven touchdown. Well, this defense, they've been terrific all year, and they come through with a pick six here on the game's biggest stage. Perfect descriptor there because we have seen this time it's and time like, again. This defense, the ability to take the ball It's like, from teams, you know, as soon as you, you, you make that action and you make a mistake, but you have to go through with it. <laughs> oh, man. Justin Tucker for the extra point. And the Ravens lead at 7 0. I was geared to go for that streak when I, when I hot routed. But then when I saw after the snap, I went, no, let's not take a chance. And I thought the back was going to be clear, but it was not. It was not. So they throw the pick six, they'll get another shot at it now. You know, we got to focus on our, on our game, and we got to run the football. That's how we start. We get things going by running the football. This one out as their drive will begin at the 25. Out comes Washington's offense as they get set to take over here. Now remember, they were just out here a moment ago through well, they the got pick them six, in the so box. we'll see if they can take better care of the football this go around. Yeah, and sometimes, partner, I think it's almost better that you just throw oh, make the block and you come right back out on the field. You're not <laughs> make the block. Going for it for very long. You're not hearing everyone say, "Oh, hey, that would have been a touchdown." Don't worry about it. All that stuff just goes right out the window. You're right back out on the field with a chance to atone. Second and six, just inside the thirty. Now they'll throw here out of the gun. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah, yeah. We saw that man coverage, baby. That mid blitz. Talk to him, Gary Clark. Talk to him, man. It's good enough for a first down. That connection seemed to work out okay on the first play of the drive. Why not go right back to We usually break those. Well, if that was our month, he would have been gone. An answer as they surrender back to back first downs. Get for me with this playbook, man. Well, they coming. They coming, bro. Now on first down, he'll drop to throw it. Uh, As a defensive back, you have some weapons at your disposal that we don't often talk about. And you can read the receiver's eyes, you can read his hands, and you know that the arrival of the ball is imminent, and that allows you to make a play on it, and oftentimes, knock it away. They'll try a little trickery. Oh. Oh. I don't think any Ravens boy, they came to play. Right they came to play. Blow up in their faces. 
Give him a loss of six yards. Never want to be third and 16, man. Never. I like the idea to mix it up from time to time because, let's face it, you can't be predictable. But the execution was a little lacking on this one, right? They might want to go back to the drawing board with that call. Two minutes on the clock in the second quarter of this Super Bowl. How to approach this. Third down and 16 yards to go. They're playing man coverage too. Dang it. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. And he's caught. And he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. That was no third and two. That was third and 16. But they get the conversion anyway. That's a play that will likely be forgotten when you talk about big moments in this oh, game. Oh, we had a beautiful place like Pl this. Plenty of time to throw. Beautiful pop. Points result. We'll call this play significant. Good throw to Charlie Taylor right there. From the 34 now, here's first and 10. Looking to throw. And it's a short one here, complete to the tight end. This will be a gain of about eight to the 27-yard line. Grant, a perfect defense in this situation would have meant that there was an incompletion that would have picked it off. Okay, so they gave up the completion. But I really enjoyed a lot of the forward. defense stayed in sync, stayed in great communication. And as he dragged across each zone, you see him pointing, communicating. There he is, and they passed him off to each defender. Ended up making a nice play, even though it was pressure applied, and he's going to be taken down. They sack him back at the 33-yard line. All right, let's see here. Ravens are playing right now. And I haven't played this game in a while, guys. <laughs> you got to get back in the groove, man. Oh, yeah, I threw it way too early. But it's to get defenders confused about who to go with. But if you throw it too early, sometimes it's your quarterback that gets confused. And here, he throws it into coverage and gets it intercepted. The Raven offense going to take over late in this first half. And with a seven-point lead, they'll likely look to take this to the locker room and not really press the issue. Now the Ravens going to use one of their timeouts as the clock stops here with 46 seconds remaining in the first half. On second down, here's Jackson. They set up the screen for Dobbins. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. And a good quarterback facing zone coverage. If he has just a little bit of time to survey the scene, that's what's going to happen. No doubt about it. If there's no pressure, he's going to continue to pick them apart because he'll have all that time to find someone open downfield. You can only cover for so long. So maybe they want to go to a zone blitz scheme, get a little bit more pressure. Remember when Carolina did that against Denver? They lost the game ultimately. They dropped the defensive end out, and he ended up with an interception in that game in Super Bowl 50. Maybe some sort of scheme like that to try and get more pressure at the They're going for a field goal, man. Good for They're going for the field goal. All that practice time came to fruition on that play. All those he got down and got out of bounds. They're going to trip tight in. Mini camp and just regular season. They got it done on that one. An out cut. Ball no! And picked up the completion. And brought down, but not before they're inside the 25. It's another first down as they look his way again, this time 19 yards. Boy, everything clicking on this drive. He's pulled for four now, and that throw may be the best of the bunch. This offense is really humming, and they pick up another first down. Hey, 
So with four seconds to go in the half, here's the field goal unit onto the field. From the right hash, it's a 41-yard attempt. Tucker's kick is good, and that will extend their lead even further. I don't remember my go-to plays had the or nothing. Lead and they get the interception, Charles, and now they add three more with the field goal. And yeah, they're in control of how this game is playing out so far. You mentioned the early lead. Now they're expanding on it, getting plays on both sides of the ball. A winning recipe if they can keep this up. Oh, a good-looking return set up here. <laughs> So we've come upon halftime in the big one, the Super Bowl. As we are Ooh. off to Orlando now to check in with Jonathan Coachman at our EA Sports Halftime Report. That's what Coach. happens when you turn the okay, ball Brandon, over. Thanks very much. What a season this has been. Hard to believe it ends tonight. As we'll get back to you guys for the second half of this Super Bowl in just a moment. It's been a tremendous season of football, but it's not over yet. One half remains to decide who will stand on the podium with the Vince Lombardi Trophy. And to call the second half, here are Brandon Godden and Charles Davis. Both teams making their final adjustments of the season during this long halftime break. Who will claim the Lombardi Trophy? To find out, we go back to Brandon and Charles in Vegas. We need a good drive right here. Super Bowl good steady NBA. drive. And this will not be returned, so the second half begins with a touchback. The Washington offense ready to go to begin the third quarter. And right now, their chances of hoisting that Lombardi trophy not looking too great, but perhaps that long halftime, maybe it did them a world of good. But if there's ever a chance to regroup, it's in this game, right? Because you do Come have on, line. Y'all been strong all year, baby. Come on now. Things and maybe make some changes and true adjustments. They played great all year long. That was the worst first half of the season for them. They're hoping to put it behind them and come out punching here in the second half. And they'll keep leaning on the running game back to the ground. And this is going to be a commander's first down as he's got this past the 35 to about the 37. Those are the type of runs that we did not see from him in the first half, but a good start to the third quarter. And I know what everyone's thinking that's watching this. They did a great job adjusting at the half. Oftentimes, you don't make adjustments. You just dial into your game plan a little bit better, and maybe you're starting to make some headway. Well, he's going to be out of bounds, but not before he takes it inside the 40. we got to do what we do best, guys. we got to get the ring to play the run game goal. First. Good job, Washington. Running left, here's Good. Patterson. And brought down, but not before they're inside the 25. 15 more there, and they're on a roll. It's another first down. <laughs> Pardon, if you want more carries, I think we saw how you get them. Show that he's got the fresh legs, and he picked up the first down on that run. Don't just ask for him. Show him that you're supposed to get the football. Now a play fake here on first down. I was a little late with that. I was a little late, but I got it. Yard touchdown. And the commanders are on the board here in this Super Bowl. So it took him a little while, Charles. I don't know, guys. I don't know if he got both feet the down. They might challenge that. In this third quarter. And more often than not, Brandon, when that happens, you find yourself down 21, 28 points. As soon as I hit this button, let's see. Yep, we there we go. The there we go. All touchdowns do have to be there we go. There we go. They're taking a peek at whether or not those feet were in bounds, and obviously One. a big call here in the end zone. And not just the feet. Oh, that's a touchdown! That's a touchdown! That's a touchdown! That is a touchdown! See if it all comes together. Yes! So they called Good it call, a touchdown Rip. originally, and this will stay a touchdown after the video review, so they had it right. Point after, right down the middle. And that'll cut it to three at 10-7. So just a three-point game now as they send this one away. And it'll come out to the 25 as come on, defense. they not attempt to return. The Ravens offense getting ready now for their first possession of the second half. 
And maybe some renewed pressure on this unit following the touchdown a moment ago. It's back to a one-score game. And because of that pressure, because it's now a one-score game, they know this is where you need to slow the momentum change because otherwise that could overrun your team. You've got to be ah, good defense, guys. Good defense. Shot down field good job, Daryl Green. Falling incomplete. They geared up and took the deep shot downfield, but it turned out it wasn't one-on-one -on -one coverage. Extra defenders in the area, and that one winds up incomplete. <laughs> Let's go defense. Let's go defense. He's belted before he could get out of the back. Reel him in, baby. Reel him in. Three yards there, and it also brings up third. They're going empty. They're going empty. Let's go deep. Spot here. They'll be in search of 13 yards to try to pick up the first. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. Oh come on, come on. And he takes us beyond the 35 before going out of bounds. His first catch of this Super Bowl, and it'll be good for a first down. Whenever we talk about moving the sticks and controlling the football, there's a great example right there. Those are the third downs you need to convert to win football games. We're in the third quarter. They're going to stay one, in the pistol, guys. They're going to stay one. in that pistol. In that's their ball. That's pace, that game right there. Keep the ball away from the other team and put points on the board. Those are the plays they need to continue to convert. And they will only muster a yard here to the 38. Come on, defense. Hang in there, baby. Play your game. A nice play design there with the touch pass. Looked good at the start, but bottom line, the defense was ready. And they did a nice job scouting, didn't they? Not just scouting, but now executing once they saw the play for real after having worked on it all week in practice. They drilled on the play, then they drilled him. Mars, he's changing the play at the line every time, seems Jackson. like. Screen play. Ah! Target and incomplete. I see the surprise in your face there, partner. That is a rare incompletion from him. He's been on point this entire game. He has percentage completion wise way up. Not that time. Again, Jackson. Get him! Now looking deep here for Flowers. Yes! And it's not How did Jackson get out of that, man? Ow! And that's a really good job there defensively. They went into this possession knowing that they needed to get a stop. They're in a tight ball game, and they got it done. Great work to force the three and out. Got the football right back for their offense. They've got to go to the sidelines feeling pretty good about themselves and encourage blocking, blocking. defensive mates to get some points. On that punt, we've got a man shaken up. We'll take a break and get a report from Vegas after this. Out there, set ready for this next drive. The Washington offense. Now, this game is man coverage again. All about the defense on both sides of the football. Which offense is going to break through here? We'll see if they can do it on this drive. Ah. Here to start the drive as they connect left side. Now, he'll get All right, this look, baby. Let's go. The 45 yard line. A well executed 22 yard gain. Press coverage on the outside, and for defenders, that's the ultimate risk reward. If you take the risk, can you reward yourself by keeping them on the line of scrimmage? But no, not on that one. Ooh. Got the step on him. Now it's just a matter of laying the ball out there for him to go get it. We are through three quarters of play here from Allegiant Stadium in Super Bowl 58. You are watching the NFL on EA Sports. Folks, welcome back to the biggest stage in sports, the Super Bowl, and now we get down to the good stuff, the fourth and final quarter. They'll bring a receiver in motion right. He'll get it here on the jump. Oh, come on! Yeah, this is not going to work as planned. He's going to be met and dropped behind the line of scrimmage. Officially, it's a one-yard loss. That's going to bring up second and 11. Come on, come on. Second down, they'll run it here. And he is going to lose yardage here. Now a pause, and there's an injured Raven in need of some assistance. We'll take a break and get a report from Vegas after this. They keep running that overstorm brave, man. I don't remember what my go-tos are, guys. I really don't. 
possibly a turning point. Big play coming. This is third and long. Back to throw here. Working yes. The of the field, and he's got a man complete. And he's going to be taken down with the they first step again, it looked like the Ravens 38-yard line. A big third down pickup of 20 yards. Tell you what, he's been able to put the ball in some tight spots all game long. That throw, no different. Yeah, a lot of people call it a gutsy type of a throw. I think he looks at it as, I can do it. So it's not that big of a deal to me. And I'm going to keep firing. So in Raven territory now, here's a first and 10 at the 38. They'll try and run this one right up the gun. And he'll manage to pick up about four at second down. Second and six coming up. And they'll give him another oh, shot. Come on! Line. And he'll be taken down at the 34. Two minute warning. Separating these two sides with two minutes left to go in the fourth. So it's Washington with the football here as we welcome you back. They face a critical third down now. Looks like they're playing man coverage, guys. So we're going to try a man coverage play here. That's my tight. There we go. They are in need of six yards here if they hope to move the chains. On third down, he'll drop to throw. He's got his turn. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Woo! Baby, I thought that was a pick. I thought it was a pick. I hesitated. I hesitated with that throw. This is where you need a quarterback who can keep his goal back there. Not just for himself. Oh, we just got it in the there. I should. I, I. I needed to throw it harder right there. I needed to throw it harder right there. Here we go. First and goal. They'll try and run for it on first and goal. And he'll be stopped just outside the five at the six. The six yard line, the line of scrimmage on second and goal. And Washington now gonna use the first of their three timeouts as he'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. They're gonna, they're gonna keep playing man coverage, I know that. Seven seconds showing on the clock. We got to go for the field goal, guys. We got to go for it. We got to go for the field goal. So here we go. Maybe the biggest kick of the game forthcoming. This to potentially send us to overtime. Now the Ravens going to use one of their timeouts. It's just mm. their first. They've got two more to use here in the final stages. <sighs> 
So on fourth down, out trots the kicker in a big spot here. This to tie things up in the final minute. Yes. And his kick here is good. And that will tie this game here in the final minute of play. I tell you, the life of a kicker. He has not been called on the entire game. He's over there by the net. But they send him out here in the fourth quarter and say, hey, go tie the game, will you? And guess what? He comes through. I just don't know how they do it. I really don't. These cats <laughs> are a different breed from you and me. That's a pressure kick, but that one was never in doubt. And with time a factor here late, he'll just take a knee and they'll put it out to the 25. And Baltimore's offense set for this next possession. And Charles, obviously not much time left. I'm curious to see if there's enough for them to get into field goal range and try to win this thing. And part of you and I both know the safe calls to kneel and just take it into overtime. But it's also very tough to pass up a chance to win it right now as well. But remember, if you do attempt that, it's got to be a big play downfield and still leave yourself enough time to get your field goal unit out there and kick for the win. Here comes second down at five. Throwing, Jackson. Connecting with Andrews. And that could be a killer. He'll lose yardage and tackled inbounds. We have free football overtime. Here we go, my friend. And the way this game played out, this is exactly how it should end, going to overtime because neither one got an advantage today. So the first chance of this overtime will go to Washington as we are back underway. And no return here to begin the overtime session. That'll be a touchback. Here comes the commander's offense back onto the field. Well, CD certainly doesn't get any more exciting than this. Overtime in the postseason. Of course, keep in mind things are different than the old way it was in the playoffs. Now, both teams guaranteed a possession, so a touchdown here, if they get one, the ball game will not be over. And, partners, we both know many people have called for this change before, and they finally got it. After the Buffalo Kansas City Classic in the 2022 playoffs, Patrick Mahomes and KC, they scored first game over Josh Allen and Bills. Never touched the football. People hated that. Now the game reaches OT. Every playoff team has a chance to fight to extend their season. So the plan has got to be. We got to go to the reliable eye formation, the guys. Reach the end zone and score and put as much pressure on your opponent as possible to try and win a game in OT in the playoffs. That one, a first down pickup of eight. A nice start for them here to overtime. And, and maybe the plan here is don't do anything too crazy. Don't try for some big play, Charles. Just move the chains, put the pressure on the defense. Well, these early first downs are certainly nice confidence builders as they begin overtime because even though you've just played four quarters, the feeling's entirely different when you take the field in OT because you just want to set I don't like that. You might jump that. I don't like that. And rely on your opponent to make Let's that do it. Let's do it. Let's mistake. do it. Back to throw now on first down. He's going to leave this for his running back. It's complete. And just three yards on the catch there. He couldn't get away. And it'll be second down. And we see another pitch and catch there to the running back. This position just continues to evolve. They become just as critical to the passing attack as a lot of receivers' tight ends because their ability to make people miss in the open field can really generate big plays for an offense. Tense moments in overtime of a Super Bowl. I don't know my playbook Remember, like I used to, guys. Don't. It as they come up on second down. Now they'll run it on the toss. <laughs> and a lane slowly materializing there as he'll get maybe a yard <laughs> up to the 35. Defensively, we always know that he is tough and run supported. I think the way he's playing a lot of man there, coverage. Let's see if we can beat it right here. Before the ball's even snapped, a great job of scouting prior to the game, then reading, reacting, and taking the right path to the ball carrier. 
It's a short one here, complete to his tight end. We gotta go for it. We gotta go for it. On third and six, they'll only pick up four. Decision time now on fourth and about a yard and a half. I can still hear my high school coach John Ford right now. I want my number one play with my number one runner over my number one blocker. Get me the first down. But some may very well playing say a lot of man coverage, way. baby. Pin them down deep and play field position. Blitz forthcoming as he'll look to throw. Woo! I'm glad he hang on. I'm glad he hung on to that football, man. We had to drop that. Wow. And an exhale there as they convert on fourth. Both sides were holding their breath there on that fourth down play, and the offense can breathe a sigh of relief. And both knew exactly where the first down markers were. You know the defense is trying to guard those sticks and try and keep people in front, but somehow, some way, those guys found a way to pick it up. They are in the field goal range, but definitely thinking touchdown. Come on, touchdown Reed. Just make a block, Reed. Make a block, ten. Reed. Come on, Reed. Make that block, Reed. Now here's a little touch pass as they tap it quickly to their receiver. And a short game down to about the 33. That's a nice job. The Ravens are playing really, really good defense, man. Really good defense right now. Conversion on it before he could get much out of it. Ball at the 33, second and nine. Now a handoff as they run left. Good block. Side. Good block. Let's go. Looking run there as he'll take this inside the 20 and down to the 18 yard line. Well, things now, Charles, looking pretty good here. A great opportunity to try to cash in for six on the opening possession of overtime. And what I'm liking, Brandon, is what I see down on the sidelines. I see a defense huddled up and ready to go, already preparing for their opportunity to go on the field and close out this game. Escaping the pressure right. Woo -woo, good job, Doug solid Williams. Gain of nine before being brought down. <laughs> second and right of the yard. One overtime. How about two? We need another. We're still even. We'll switch sides and have that second overtime in just a moment. Well, if you like drama, especially in the biggest of all games, we are back for the second overtime now in the Super Bowl. CPU's running the same old defense, man. Right of scrimmage the they are not giving up nothing. Shotgun handoff. Yes, calls. And the commanders are going to have it first and goal as he'll take this down mm -hmm. about the three. Uh, we give enough respect to the big guys up front because they have been getting it done on this drive. The holes have been large and they've been barreling through and picking up first downs. He can just block that corner on the left side right there. Just block him. Because I know he's looking to the inside. They'll try to run this one in. They're able to get a couple here, but won't get across the plane as they stop it right around the one. All of a sudden, those lanes that were there earlier in the drive dry up near the goal line. That's a good job defensively to diagnose the run and stop it for a very short pickup. They'll try again. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Washington. A touchdown run there from a yard out. Joe Washington, baby. Let's go. Let's go. Beautiful blocking on the left side. And Beautiful Jones blocking on the left side. Doesn't win him the game anymore with the rule changes and overtime in the postseason, but they still went down, scored, got the job done, and now they put it in the hands of their defense. And with the other side now guaranteed an overtime possession, getting that score was vital. The pressure's now on their opponent, and their defense, they have to play off the momentum the offense generated. One stop, and they end this game. All right, defense, it's up to you. It's up to you, defense. They send this one away. <laughs> and this will not be brought out. It's a touchback. And now Baltimore gets set to take the field. Well, CD, in the regular season, they would already be celebrating. Not so simple here in the playoffs. Now they also need to make a defensive stand if they want to pick up the victory. Yeah, I'm sure the They're team keep would be playing trips, man. Just taking the win right now, but in a small way. Those defenders are also kind of happy for the world change because now, on the big stage of postseason, they're the ones who can come out here 
and lock down the victory. World, world class tight end right there, man. 13 yards picking up the first. So CD in the postseason obviously get the chance to answer that I want to I want to blitz some guys, but I can't take a chance. We got to be patient. We got to be patient. Knowing that their entire season They're going to stay in trips, man. Series. What a great question, and I don't think that they set it aside. I think that they confront it, and they've done it throughout practice time in preparation for opportunities like this. What I love about watching the passing game nowadays is that the one-dimensional receiver is really starting to leave the game. You've got to be able to do it all. Of course, you've got to run fast. Of course, you've got to catch the ball. But route running savvy and toughness Ooh. is premium for all of that now. And now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. Second and ten. I don't remember what the blitz is, guys. I was gonna blitz him and man him up. I gotta remember what that play is. Now Jackson. Oh yes, it's over. It's over, baby. It's over. It is over. It is over. Super Bowl champs, those Washington Commanders have had a successful season. The best team in the NFL, number one seed going into the playoffs, and we get it done in the Super Bowl. Yes, in great fashion with the pick six. Oh, we're looking at the Super Bowl champs, baby. The Super Bowl champs, what's going on, y'all? You win this baby in overtime. You might remember Dwight Smith and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers had two. This was our toughest game of the season, man. And, it, and, and, and it's in the Super Bowl. You mentioned Tracy Porter already. How about James Harrison? Look at the confetti. Get the confetti out of the field, man. The half ended. That was a big time play. Yeah, that's for me, the absolute that's classic. Go, boys. Willie Brown in slow motion against yeah, the Yeah, we win the Super Bowl, Raiders. baby. Let's go. Let's go. Celebrate. I hope they got the wine ready in the locker room. I hope they got the wine ready in the locker room. Yeah, present that trophy, baby. Present that trophy. Yeah, there we go. Number one. That's our quarterback, Doug Williams, right there, baby. Let's go. Look at it. Look at it. Hold that trophy up, boy. Woo-wee. Yes. A very successful season. All right, guys. This is my last Madden 24 video. You know, Tuesday, Monday, whenever it is, I'm going to be going live with Madden 25. So, again, if you are new to my channel, hit that subscribe button, guys. Hit that notification bell so you'll be notified when I go live. All right? I'm Hollywood Sports. Thanks for watching. We are Super Bowl champs, and I will see you in Madden 25.